With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so today's question is P is a point inside the triangle ABC. Lines are drawn through P parallel to sides of a triangle. The three resulting triangles with vertex at P have square areas. 4, 9, 49 square units. The area of triangle ABC. So first of all we have given a triangle. So let this make a triangle. This is your triangle ABC. And P is a point inside the ABC. So let it, this will be your P point. This and we have its cutting to this point. So you can see that this is what is a line parallel to this side. Which is something FG. And this line passing through P point. This is parallel to this. You can say this will be DE. And similarly, this line is parallel to this, that is AB. And this line be what? I, H. This is our let out points. Now, you can see that DE is parallel to, this DE is parallel to AC. Similarly, you can see that FG, this is what is FG. This FG is parallel to BC. So, FG is parallel to BC. And similarly, IH is parallel to AB. So, you can see that IH is parallel to AB. This we have. So, we have given in the question that lines are drawn through P parallel to sides of the triangle. So, this is what we have given. The three resulting triangles with the vertex at P. So, this is the vertex and we have three re resulting triangles like this 1, 2 and 3. We have these triangles and let we have given that area is this. So, you can say that triangle PIE which is 49. PIE this is 49 square units. Triangle PDF that is P, D, F. This triangle, this is what is something 4. And triangle P, G, H. That is what is P, G and H. This triangle, this triangle and this triangle. This is what? This is 9. So, you can see that this triangle and this triangle is similar to each other. Or you can see that because it has this and this. And the angle is also like congruent property. So, you can see that triangle P, G, H is congruent to triangle P I E. So you can say that H P the ratio of H P and P I this side is what root 9 divided by root 49 that the because the square a that the ratio of the square is equals to the ratio of this area. So when you remove the square it will be in root. So root 9 by root 49 that is something with root 9 is 3 and root 49 is 7. So this is the ratio. So this is what is I P divided by IH you can write this this is what 7 by 10 7 by 10 similarly as you know that triangle PIE is also similar to triangle congruent to triangle HIC and their ratio again like this you have you can write this 10 square to 10 square and area of triangle HIC is what this area of HIC this area will be the total of that that is 100 so, area of a parallelogram PGCE. PGCE is a parallelogram. Here this is P, this is G, this is C and this is E. This is what is, this is a parallelogram. So, what is the area for this? This will be total area is 100. And when you deduct the area of this, that is what is 9 minus 9. So, this will be. And also this area that is what is 49 so you can also deduct this so this area will be 42 so area of parallelogram pgc is what 42 similarly the second parallelogram that is area of parallelogram pibf that is pibf this area that means total minus this and this so again you can say that this will be root 4 plus root 49 the whole square minus 4 minus 49 so this will be what so this will be 81 minus 53 which is equals to 28. So this is the area of parallelogram PIBF. Now the third parallelogram that is area of parallelogram PDAH. What is PDAH? That is PDAH. This is also a parallelogram. So we are going to have this area minus this and this. So what is this? The whole area that is root 4 plus root 9 the whole square. This is 4 minus of 4 minus of 9 the smallest area triangle and this is same. This will be 25 minus 13 is equals to 12. So this is also the what we need to find. We need to find area of triangle ABC. So you can add all these parallelogram area which is nothing but 49 plus 4 plus 9. The area of small small triangles that is 
small triangles and area of parallelograms so we have found the area of parallelograms which is 1 is 12 this is 12 and 1 is here this 42 and 1 is here this 28 so you can add all which is nothing but 144 so this is your area and option number d is correct that is 144 thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today